This is Eric Glenwood, back with you with more self elevate EDF slash Spring Power Universal Exoskeleton Armor update. And I um, got the knee pads in, and I'm finna basically start that artificial spine. But I was shooting this video because I wanted to say the best part about having a modular exoskeleton is that if I want, like right now, I'm finna start the spine. I can pull that belt off, and then I can actually uh, do all my machine work and my fabrication on the belt and um, actually get it done and um, basically separate it from the exoskeleton. So I can take it off and I can um, drill my holes, mount my tube structure, mount my springs, and work my way up the spine without it being attached to the legs. If I want that thigh, work on it, I can pull it off and it just slides right out and I can do work on it, slide it back in. Same thing with that thigh, same thing with each one of the boots. So that's the thing cool about being modular, especially even me just building it and fabricating it. Instead of me trying to wrestle the whole set of legs, um, I can actually, like I said, just do a boot, left, uh, right boot, left thigh, right thigh, pull the belt off, work on the spine, chest piece, find work on the arm, just working on the arm. I, ain't, I can just literally grab it and slide it off the exoskeleton. I ain't got to grab it, unclip it, undo things, undo bolts and wiring and hydraulic units and things of that nature. Any part of it. And then that's the cool part about that. You can always have backup. You can have backup thigh, backup boots, backup that. So if anything happened, if you don't have time to repair, I can just change them out. Added to the simple fact that it's modular and you can basically take that thigh plate off and, and put an EDF jet utility or clip holder um, mounted thigh plate or whatever you want else you want to do to it. And um, that's the cool part about it being modular. It's changeable. Um, I can design another pair of boots if I don't want those, that set of um, boots. And I can basically just take those off and have, put the other boots on and exoskeleton is still complete once I get my dimensions right. I said, same thing with the thigh, same thing with the back, the belt, the chest, and the arms. This is Eric Glenwood. Have a good day, night, or evening.